Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, Joe Suds and Soaps. Uh, what I wanted to do today, I am going to be using this, um, which is really pretty, this lavender color block. I'm using the mermaid blue color block, and I'm going to keep the uh, goat's milk white. I went ahead and made some embeds. The other two are setting up. I think four is all I'll be able to fit, but you can see. I love this mold of this tulip. Got it from Amazon. I've gotten most of my molds from Amazon. Okay. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to melt this down 30 seconds at a time. Take it out. After 30 seconds, I'm going to stir it. Keep stirring it, um, you know, until you can manually, try and manually uh, stir all that you can. Uh, the problem is if it overheats, then it's it may turn um, like a brownish. It could change the uh, smell. And it's usually not too attractive. Actually, now this is from, this is crazy. This, this actually was because of the fragrance oil I used, but you can see how dark. That was a, this was this green here. Because I didn't use, um, this is because of the pumpkin, the pumpkin fragrance oil. Okay. So I'm not going to add a fragrance today because I only have pumpkin and I don't want this to turn. So I'll be back, guys, I would say in about five minutes or so. See you then. Okay, I'm going to melt down um, the colors here. Let's see. Now I might have to put it back in the microwave. These tend to not want to mix up. Still gonna put it in the microwave though for a little bit. Yeah, I'm gonna put it in the microwave and I'll be right back. Okay, we ended up with this really beautiful uh, lilac purple. And this really pretty like bluish green. That's more like a blue. It does have some green in it. It's beautiful. And then we ended up with the goat's milk. All right, let me take, let me do this and then I'm gonna take the temperatures. Yeah, this is 131. And this is about 135. Okay, about the same for that. So I'm going to start the pour. And I'm going to prime it with rubbing alcohol. That's going to help it. Um, it's going to be easier to take out. It's going to give a kind of a sheen. It'll prevent... Um, Air bubbles, or the bubbles, the look of, of them. All right, let me do, I want you to see it, and I want to be able to see it. And I'm going to be going white in between. Yeah, I was so in the mood to soap. These look more like cotton candy collars, I think. Now the higher I pour here, the more penetration, so it'll go to the bottom. All right, so I'm gonna do some more white here, and then I'll do some blue. And I'll top it off with the white, if I have enough. I love these colors.
particularly together. Wow. Okay. All right. I'm going to see you guys, I would say, in about two hours or so. See you then. Okay. We are back. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to spray um, with rubbing alcohol where I'm going to place the flowers. And I did, I went ahead and melted down about uh, two ounces of goat's milk. So I'm just going to put this on the top. All right, now... I want to be able to cut it and not have to cut through the flowers, so we'll see. Okay, I'm going to let these set, guys, um, I would say for a good another hour, hour and a half, because I only let it set for an hour. Okay, we'll see you soon. Okay, we're back. I bring the lamp over, I always do that. Okay, I'm going to cut this. I'll be right back. Okay, we're back. Boy, I think they turned out beautiful. Very pretty. Very nice. Just the other two more. And there's the back side. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please press the like button, comment down below, become a subscriber. Once you do become a subscriber, just hit that notification bell and you'll be notified when I release new videos. Thank you so much and have a great day.